You're here today to learn about five tips that can help you sell your home fast and not spend a lot of money. Let's keep it cheap. Welcome, it's Eric Harris, your veteran realtor, and we're gonna talk about the five things you can do to sell your home fast and not have to upgrade everything. Number one, make sure that you get the lighting right. Everything is about lighting. The better the lighting, the more you can see. If you went to the jewelry store, all the jewelry is under lights, so they look brighter, they shine better. When you go buy a TV, they have more lights on it. The screen looks different. The picture looks clear. The more lights you have in your house, the clearer your house looks. When you're showing the house, make sure you open up the blinds when uh, buyers come in to view it. So make sure all the lights are in the house. You have new lights, they're all lit, and they're all the same color. If you have different lights in different rooms, it could throw the aligning off a little bit. So if you have like a white looking light, then you have the, the yellow light. That could throw the light off. Make sure the lights are the same color to make it the brightest possible. Step number two, paint your door. I cannot explain how many times I've told people to paint their door and it just makes the house look better. Preferably, I tell people neutral colors are red. For some reason, people love to see red doors. I think it's like a flipping thing when people are used to seeing new houses and the door's usually like red or blue and it just attracts people naturally. It's like a subconscious thing. I actually told one of my friends to paint their door in Florida where he was having a hard time selling the home. And once he did that a week later, he had more offers than he could count. Step number three, declutter. Don't leave everything out. A lot of times it's good to just put everything in the garage. Actually, when people come to see the home doing an open house, we tell people like everything's in the garage. Don't They don't feel bad about the garage being cluttered because most people clutter the garage anyway. Therefore, it's better to put everything in the garage and keep all the personal stuff outside the house. You'd be surprised, like if you're a big sports fan, somebody sees that you are a Patriots fan, they don't like the Patriots. It actually sets their mood down and it takes away from the house. Subconscious, we wanna to play to the mindset of the buyer. So declutter the home, take out a lot of the personal stuff, keep everything neutral, keeps everything uh, open and let them visualize the house as their own also. Step four, make sure that you shine all the silver, all the brass. Just a couple of shines here and there, wipe things off. It makes the house look newer. Newer the house looks, the better it is. If you really wanna step it up, bonus tip, get a paint job. It's cheaper than upgrading countertops and everything. Shine the brass and maybe do a paint job. If you can't afford a paint job, shine the brass, the silver. Shine the knobs on the uh, cabinet handles. Makes everything look better and saves you money. Last tip for the day, get a professional cleaning. Everything is about having everything look open, look clean, look bright. The newer something looks, the better it looks to the buyer. A lot of people try to clean it themselves, but the professionals, they come in, they clean up all kinds of stuff. You just have to make sure with the decluttering we told you about earlier, everything is out their way and it makes everything easier for them to make your house look sparkling and almost brand new. If you like these tips and want to learn more, click the link below. We have a whole list of tips out there for you. And thank you for tuning into this video. Talk to you next time. See you next Tuesday. Bye.